Here's a how to use Leonardo AI tutorial, including how to access Leonardo AI prompts, how to create stunning AI art for free with Leonardo AI, plus a quick look at Leonardo AI image to image. Midjourney V5 sets the benchmark, but isn't free. This free Midjourney V5 alternative is the best AI art generator there is out there in my opinion. In this Leonardo AI tutorial, we'll explore the best strategies for getting early access to Leonardo AI art image generator. Let's get into the Leonardo AI tutorial, the best mid-journey V5 alternative. First thing we're going to do is come over to Google and search for Leonardo AI. Click on the first result that comes up, and that will take you to the homepage of Leonardo.ai. This tutorial will show you how to sign up for exclusive early bird access, and that's the same as getting into the alpha program. So all you need to do is put in your email and you'll get that email flying your way, it says. And you can see here from the email that by doing these things, you can expedite access by completing the form that we'll show you in a minute, engage and earn as a community member. And I believe doing that in Discord helps. If you're eager to get your hands on this exciting new platform, you might be wondering how to get early access. To speed things up, to become a member and user of Leonardo AI, you wanna join the Leonardo AI Discord group. So go ahead and click this link, then just put in your username and click continue. But if you've already got an account for Discord, just go ahead and log in. And I'll just welcome myself back here, thank you. Once the invite is accepted, you'll come into the Discord group so here's a little welcome just close this off and yeah put in your language it says to gain access sooner you want to join the discord group and just become a little bit active in there it doesn't take much let's go for that right now and on the discord here feel free to check out the getting started guide the rules the general section off topic bot commands check them out while you wait for your access maybe check out the frequently asked questions but in general, just playing around inside here, send off a couple of messages. It sends a message to Leonardo that you have been active in the group. So go ahead and play around here and you'll find that you get access even sooner. It only took me a day or a day and a half to receive my invite to play around with the early bird access of the alpha Leonardo AI. And I do believe it's because of going in the discord that helped me get there. Another thing you can do is to go into the Leonardo AI whitelist Google Sheet here. As you can see in the Discord, it also suggests that you go into the Google Sheet here to fill out some of your details. And that's another little tip to get access a little bit sooner. So just go through and fill out your details here, put in your Discord user ID, and then you can see here your response has been recorded. So that'll tell me that I can get access a little bit sooner. So here is the Leonardo AI homepage. You can see some of the things that we can do here. Check out an existing model, train your own AI models, which we'll see in a minute, and discover unlimited potential. And you certainly can with this, as you can with most AI art generators. Here are a few examples of other people's work. These types of things look like they're very much centered around art for gaming, but you don't necessarily need to do that in Leonardo AI. Here are a few examples, just flicking through. There's some pretty amazing art here, and then you can even use it for simple art like this. It even gives you a little toolbox to choose different types of things in the event of you wanting to make art for a game, which is pretty unlikely, because I don't want to do that, and it's not a normal thing for people to do, but you can choose these little toolboxes for creating those types of things that appear as the art in some online games. Again, here you can see the option to get early access to the alpha, so here's another option, or you can just go back to the top of the page. Okay, once you've got this email that you can come in and join Leonardo AI, which only took a bit over a day, go ahead and you actually need to sign up. Make sure you use the same email address that you used when you clicked on the early alpha access. Go ahead and put in your details, make a password, and put in your verification code. Once confirmed, you can see that we now have access to Leonardo AI. So the first thing you need to do is choose a username. So I'm gonna go with my Tim Harris video. Go through and click some of your interests for me. It's going to be these ones here. We'll skip through this, but basically I am using it to show people Leonardo AI tutorials and also Leonardo AI image to image. 
Once logged in, you can see here is the home page for Leonardo AI, and here are some examples. And looking at the community feed, we can see some of the recent designs of other users. Personal feed, there's nothing here yet, but when you produce some content, this is where it will show up. There's also a section where you can train your own data set of images. And then we've also got featured models. So these are different types of models that we can use as a basis for when we create our image. Next, we have the actual AI image generator section, followed by the AI canvas. Then we have the texture generation. So there's plenty of different things in here we don't see in other AI art image generators. Quickly going over settings, here's my profile. You can see that these are the things I filled out earlier. And for the API, you'll need to pay extra, so forget about that for now. Coming back to the AI image generator tool, this is the main area for Leonardo AI. We've got a couple of different models we can use. Here you can add a negative prompt to take out things you don't want in the image that you've created. And then when you put in your prompts, you click the generate button right here. You can see in the corner here, we've got 150 tokens, that's per day. So this refreshes after, I think it's actually 18 hours. So it's one token per image. So we'll click one image. You've got prompt magic. You can choose your dimensions of your image. And you've also got the guidance scale, which creates the image based how loosely or tightly on the prompt you have that you want. Next, we've got a couple of advanced options here, followed by the Leonardo AI image to image and image to prompt section, which is quite advanced. We'll just show this briefly, but we won't really go into it today. Great, so let's actually go in and do a test prompt. I'd like Leonardo AI generator to produce an image like a close up of a beautiful redhead goddess with a starry background that is photorealistic. And this is like a moonshot. And in one attempt, we've got an amazing photo that pretty much is exactly what I asked for. I don't really even need to make any changes, but you can open up the picture and choose a few different options here if you want. You can upscale, which costs a few more tokens. There's a few other options here, which cost a few more tokens, but you get 150 tokens per day that regenerate after, as I said, 18 hours or a day. So this is actually quite fantastic. But for now, we'll just go with the standard process of upscaling. And then I can just download this image. If I wanted to take out a couple of features from this photo, I can just use add negative prompt and go ahead and take that out. But I'm pretty happy with this image as it is. Leonardo AI is a new platform that has garnered a lot of attention in recent months. With its innovative tools and cutting edge technology, Leonardo AI promises to revolutionize the way we think about machine learning and AI. Now check out this video to see how to use ChatGPT plugins with OpenAI ChatGPT4. Also subscribe to the channel so you can get more AI updates as they happen. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.